We'll get there eventually, so keep the scoring down to two. We'll clear the man inside the uh, circle for four. And that goes well inside, almost in a catching position. So he's already he's trusting this pitch to play that shot. Shot. Oh, we're seeing some good shots here already. And that's as good as any you will see. 50 in the seventh over. That's a good shot. That's pitched further up. And it's gone way back into the crowd. He's in terrific touch, Rohit Sharma. Great shot to end the over. Eight of it, 60 for no loss. Well, this is a magnificent shot. Not all that wrong a delivery. He's just on a very good wicket. This off from uh, Nagpur, so to speak. Big shot is giving him out. First wicket of the... And Doherty has got Shikhar Dhawan out. Leg before wicket. Just before the break of 28 minutes. There's a pitch in line. Yes, it does. Just a bit of turn. And he was gone. He was plumb in front. Bit of drift. Pitches in line. A hint to turn. The hit middle, middle and leg. And I could not believe it. He's gone for 60. And they're 112 for one. There it is. Off the mark, he's pretty quick. Oh, 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 he's out, run out. Yes and no situation. He wanted the single. Rohit Sharma slipped and run out a duck. It's a big blow. It's a massive blow. And, the, and he's gone, disappointed. He's gone for a duck. It's 113 for two. That's a good delivery. Coming back into Rohit Sharma. That'll bring up his 50. A very well made, got a lot of work to do though. Nine overs. Shot! Has he got enough on this? Oh yes, he has. That's gone way into the second. On the distance. The new Glenn Maxwell is the weak link. To the stands. Very good use of the feet. It's bounce in this pitch. And it goes the distance, 96 meters. Good batting. A single to follow. Well. Oh, he's lofted him straight. That's a fabulous looking stroke, and it's six. He's just put his feet on the accelerator, Rohit Sharma. There was a lull period in between after the loss of Sharma, are turning it on now. It's a good shot. It's gone wider this time. And it's the same result. It's another six. And it's the 50 partnership between Rohit Sharma and Suresh Raina. That's even a better shot. This time over mid on, straight up. It's not an easy shot to a left arm spinner. Here. Now, I hope there's not a problem here with Watson. He said something to George Bailey there now. He ran up and obviously didn't feel he could let the ball go. And there was just a little word there to his skipper. And a shake of the head. There's a problem here with Watson. There really is. He's not going to be able to, co to continue here, Watson. Have a look here. Something's gone here. Maybe a muscle pull. He couldn't. He started to load up. And you can see the grim is a huge blow for Australia. There's a shake of the head, he said to his captain immediately, I can't continue. And that is... Goes again. Fancies another place in the stands and he finds it. Well, Rohit Sharma's got the markers set. His fifth six. He's using his feet, you knew, you knew it was coming. Just hitting the toe of the bat, but it's the extension of the arm. This time over mid-wicket. And the same result. Two sixes in the previous over and a couple more this over. 54 gets to the pitch, hits it on the bounce and over the mid-wicket fielder. Ah! Big appeal once again, up goes the finger. Nigel loss. Let's see if he got a bit of inside edge. Yes, it, uh, as you know, you can see how even uh, Shikhar Dhawan was out. Yeah, that hits the pad first, so good decision. Have a look here, it pitches outside, straightens, and that would have hit middle stump. Now, this is a carbon copy of Shikhar Dhawan's dismissal. Reiner goes for 28. 
It's a miscue. But in the end, he'll be safe. It's gone a long, long way. Hasn't come from the middle of the bat, but it's gone the distance. This played it very late. He can get a boundary. A 200 comes up for India. It's then taken. What a catch! Unbelievable catch this. It was travelling so very quickly. And Brad Haddon pulls out a beauty. Making him drive, but he'll be disappointed. He's just getting it's a superb catch. This ball was travelling. There's no one at slips. That's a great grab with that left hand of his. And that wicket again comes for 12. It's 207 for four. Oh, that's a beauty. Oh, two great things about that one. He's bowled that ball to a batsman who's batting 96. Brad Haddon's one. Comes in quite significantly off the seam and starts to swing that direction as well. Once again, magnificent footwork. Gee, he's good, isn't he, Brad? Well, he goes through with the shot. Doesn't time it too well, but that's good enough for, for him to get to his 100. Well played, Roy Sharma. His second in the series. And further confirmation that... Well played. Well, the crowd's going absolutely bozo here. Yeah. And they've witnessed once again something really special here. Well, he's just pinned the ears back here. What a magnificent stroke. His seventh, six of the innings. One can't help but think... Well, I think there's a part of him that said, I need to, because 22 balls in the power play had produced nine runs. But it's, it's, a, it's a shot you would have seen 10, 15 years ago. I don't think he's timed that, but he's hit it where he wants to. He's opening up now. Now that is well timed. The previous one not quite so, but this one a feast to. All right, here's another one. He's found the fielder. No, well, well, well. He's, he's compounded that. Pull off some really good ones, but on the boundary, this is your watch. Well, he's hit it crisply as well. But you'd put your house on Moses and Reeking taking this nine out of ten times. Oh, that's huge. You could just tell from the sound the moment it left bad place. Six number nine for Rohit Sharma. Driven beautifully through the covers. He's picked his spot. Pony pulls. One bounce over the rope. Pulls again. This time, the placement is once again... One strike. Swings and finds the boundary. And he does that. Finds the gap on the offside. Giving himself room. Brings up the 150. And this is turning out to be a fabulous mark from Rohit Sharma. Teammates on their feet. Well, it's a very noisy crowd. If there was a sound, I think only Mackay heard it. He was confident. Definitely heard something. It was a slower delivery over an extra cover. There it is, uh, the slow off spinner. And there was just a little bit of a nick. Or so. Oh, that's picked away on the onside. Deep square leg can only be a spectator. So the ball sails into the crowd. He's dealing in sixes at the moment. That is a record for India in one-day internationals. 11 sixes now for Rohit Sharma. Inside out, over backward point. Not a boundary here. And a great start to the over. Six, now a four. That's a full toss. Sixteen off the over. Out for it. Just managed to get his back there. In the park, the helicopter shot. There it is. Oh, the chopper. And Sharma goes into the crowd again. These are some big sixes being hit. It's a low full toss. 
And it's banged over the head of mid-off. Another over starts with a six. The spectators better watch out here. Keep your eyes on the ball. Well, I think they need helmets in the crowd. Oh, beautifully played. Now that's class. He goes inside out. And what a way to bring up 200 in One Day Internationals. They call him Hitman. And he's arrived to the party. An outstanding double hundred for Rohit Sharma. The second hundred coming in just 42 balls. Sixes in a one, one day innings. What an innings this has been. What a knock this has been. And again, he's just picking his spot in the crowd, yeah. internationals. And my word, they're throwing the kitchen sink now at everything. The balls disappearing everywhere. Flicked away, he'll find the fielder. Yes, taken this time in the deep. So magnificent innings from Rohit Sharma comes to an end. Zad the substitute diving forward. He wasn't quite able to get uh, enough of bat on this. But what an innings this has been from Rohit Sharma. Magnificent stuff. Shots all around the park. Even the Australians walking down to congratulate him because they know that they've uh, been at the receiving end of something very, very special. Cramped him for room, therefore you can see not able to free his arms. Still he got enough on it, but not quite out of the middle. So Enrique is taking that catch. Look to him. 374 for five in the 50th over. And that Spiller has to take cover. So does the umpire. That went like a tracer bullet. That was hit so, so hard by uh, Mahendra Singh Dhoni. That's four ball. Finds the fielder in the deep, will get uh, a single, he wants to come back for the second uh, and will be run out. So he's sacrificing his wicket in the end, uh, looking for that extra run. But it's been a magnificent performance by the Indian after playing his hand. An ex excellent 62 of just 38. So India making 383 for 6 from their 50 overs. Wonderful innings, fabulous hitting, 383 for six from their 50 overs for India, 19 sixes in the year in one day as, and he became the third man to score 200 in this form of the game. 62 for Mahendra Kopp to shot of Dhoni's, wow. So no Mitchell. And straight away, in the gap. It's a quick outfield. He did all the hard work and then lapped it over, so good start for Australia. Uh, up goes the finger, the first wicket. Now, what's that guy? You could see a couple of stamps, maybe. Nigel Long and Saurav Ganguly. That looked plump. I don't think there is any doubt in it. That's out. And a good decision by Nigel. Aaron Finch stores over. He's dismissed for five. Australia, seven for one. Yes, he's connected on that one. And uh, that's enough to send the ball over the ropes. He's connected that too. That's a much better shot. It's not the easiest to play. Hey, how well has he hit the pads? And there is a leg slip in position. And a deep square leg. So easy runs. Worked away nicely. It's a very fast outfield. And once again, Bhuvnesh Vakuma straying onto the pads of Phil Hughes. Doesn't all oh what a shot. This is a very, very good shot. It's gonna be a boundary. Ten coming off the over. Brad hadn't taken his chances. He's been sent up the order for that. 56 for one. Two fielders in the deep, but it's in the gap. One bounce four. Great shot this. Oh. He's taken a wicket of the first ball. And I don't know what happened, but only he's fallen back. But Phil Hughes flicks a half volley to mid wicket. And a wicket of the first ball for Ravi Chandran Ashwin. It's a very good start for Ashwin. There's no better feeling as a bowler when you pick up a wicket of the first ball. All the pads, the bottom man coming into play, so the ball was in the air, and Yuvraj Singh doesn't miss too many catches. Delight for Ashwin. Wicket number eight in the series, Hughes. Got off to a bit of a start, he's gone for 23, it's 64 for two. Did it pitch in line is the question. Big, big appeal. Ashwin was optimistic. 
from that angle. You'll have to see. With piston line. That didn't turn enough. Again, finding the fielder in the deep. He's got a good arm. Yuvraj Singh. Oh, this could be trouble. He cannot believe it. George Bailey. He is gutted. He was looking behind to make sure that uh, Haddon got uh, to the crease and good presence of mind by the bowler. Vinay Kumar, have a look at this. Well, I just do not understand what he was doing here. I mean, he was just for all money worried about his partner and then he's gone, my goodness, I'm out of... completely the most absurd thing I've seen in cricket. Oh, Another one bites the dust. Well, Dhoni has asked, uh, not too sure, uh, the Indians are celebrating. Now, I think uh, what's happened here is, uh, I think the ball's hit the stumps. Dhoni's not sure whether his glove hit the stumps as well. He's bowled him. Mm, there's no question, I, I wonder why uh, Dhoni was uh, telling the Empire to take another look. That's clear cut. It was a sound, the Indians were confident, the ball had hit the off stump. And Ashwin being rewarded uh, for some very good bowling here. He mentioned he was bowling at a very good pace. Haddon now departs for 40 and Australia reeling at the moment. 74 for 4. Oh, that's big. Maxwell first ball. Puts it into the crowd. Much needed this for Australia. 80 for 4. Holes again, he'll uh, get only a single. And in fact, we'll get uh, four. He's uh, losing balance there, Yuvraj conceding the boundary. Swings, gets four more. It's an all out attack now from young Glenn Maxwell. That's massive. That's as good a shot as any we've seen today. We've seen a flurry of sixes, but that's a beauty. Already on 22 of just five balls. Well, hold the phone. Hold the phone. This is a fantastic strike. Again, short, down leg sides, small boundaries, and Maxwell pouncing on that mistake, putting it straight up into the upper decks of this pavilion. 17 off this over. Just what Australia needed. He goes again. High in the air and into the crowd once again. This is a biggie. 23 runs of the over. 103 for four. Beautifully struck. The deft touches. A little bit of width. Maxwell races on to 40 off just 12 deliveries. Oh, that's well played. Let's put that into the crowd. It stays hit when he strikes the ball. 50 partnership in just 24 balls. How about that? That is another six. It goes over extra and it equals the Australian record for the fastest ODI. His name goes alongside Simon O'Donnell. Oh, look at that. He's destroyed Verge's stumps. Mohamed Shami struck again. That's a brilliant piece of bowling. Yeah, you can dance. Got this great ability to get the ball to nip back in. I think he's probably beaten him for pace. He's played across the line as well, trying to work the ball away towards square leg. Missed it completely. The next time's gone uh, for a ride. And it's 132 for five. Rogers out for four. Maxwell goes again. This is incredible. Smash hitting. That is what uh, Maxwell is looking for because he's throwing his bat at just about everything. He knows that it's on the... Uh, Shot of a length area around the off stump. Nice easy swing. There it is. Nice easy swing. Smack bang of the middle of the bat. Oh, nice. Could have made a sweet sound as well. The eyes have it. The eyes have it. <laughs> Maxwell, 60 from 21. That reflects in a strike rate of 285. Here goes Vinay Kumar. 
Well, he's gone big again. Has he got enough on it? There's a mate. Jadeja takes the catch. Maxwell's got to go. It was brilliant while it lasted. It was wonderful to watch. Come to a short end. Banging the ball in short. Didn't get up high as much as Vinay Kumar would have wanted. But because Maxwell was on the front foot and not on the back foot, he wasn't quite able to control it. He's out. The sky are taken well by Jaria. 138 for six. It's just a little bit of tension under the surface here. A couple of things said here and there. It just adds to the occasion. He's trying to sort of, you know, mimic mimic uh, the fact that Watson's got injured. You know, that did look like uh, it wasn't in the best uh, taste. But anyway, it's come and gone. Uh, it's, uh, there's a lot going on here. Shikatawan and Shane Watson. Question is, who started it? Who's... Watson heaves him over mid-wicket for six. Bit of contempt in that shot from Shane Watson. 150 up for Australia. Watson gets it through extra this time. Four. Smashed away by Watson. You know what? Wow, what a size this going. Second tier. <laughs> Watson is making a statement. Here's another one. It's flatter this time, but it's the same result. Six more. There's another one. Here she goes. 22 off the over. Watson is wrecking Kumar. It's 177 for six from 25. Smash straight back, and that's gone at such a rate of knots. No chance for the fielder. It's four, and it's 50 partnership. Yes! Hit very hard. Six from that over from Ashwin. 190 for six from 27. The Faulkner's gone big. It's gone the distance as well. 32 sixes in the... That's the quicker delivery. They're appealing. And up goes the finger. Well, well, well. Shadeja into the attack and he's picked up a wicket. And a very important wicket for Watson. Where did that come from? Look, as a bounce somewhere. Well, I've got no clue at all what it's happened here. You see, there's... I think it's gone off the top of his knee. Oh, my goodness me. When it's not your night, it's not your night. One thing that has to happen, though, is that Shane Watson has to depart the ground. Sprightly innings, 49. Australia, 205 for seven. It's in the air, deep mid-wicket. Oh, he's put it down. Mohamed Shami, the fielder in the deep, was a simple catch. But I think he had his mind on the rope. He was very close to the boundary line. And he didn't get into a good position. He pushed it through a little flatter. Didn't bounce. He's looking for the big one. A long off. Virat Kohli. Takes a simple catch. Australia lose yet another wicket. He's safe as a house. And he's quiet for the moment. The man to go is Nathan Kutanayan. And Jadeja gets the wicket. His second. Well, he's tried for the big one. Had the length. But safely taken. Oh, the joy. The elation. He's got to go. Kuda Nile dismissed. For just three. Australia now. 211 for eight. Chadija now. This flat is gone. Dealing in sixes here. The Faulkner it is. This second six. This is a tremendous blow. 
Even though Australia is getting absolutely pummeled here, I tell you what, we're still seeing a constant flow of sixes. 34 sixes in this match. Oh, and he's dropped him. That was coming back like a tracer bullet again. He's not dying wondering here one bit, James Faulkner. He's fired up. Oh, that is absolutely smashed out of the ground. James Faulkner is just having a feast of sixes here. It's a buffet of sixes today. Let's go and find It'll be four. Just providing too much width and it was quicker through the air at 93 k's. He's got a piece of this as well. Rohit Sharma takes a heroic dive to his right, but it just doesn't stick. Straight off the bat for all money, it looked like it was going to be a, a six. A very nice attempt, though. Sharma in the deep. Struck nicely by James Faulkner. Look at this. He was close to the boundary line. And it would have been a definite six. That'll be his 50. A very good half century from Faulkner. 15 runs of the over, 33 overs bowled, 240 for 8. There'll be four more. Low full toss, no protection in the deep on the offside apart from long off. And he's worked it nicely, opening the face of the bat. This time through the offside and that'll be another boundary. Using his feet and opening up the offside. Change in era, that'll go for 4-2. They might as well put four in the book. 50 of the partnership comes up in uh, 27 balls. Oh, that's gone for 4-2. How hard did he hit it? Because I'll tell you, the gap between the two fielders there wasn't very large. And they are two of India's best fielders. Yep. That'll go for four as well. It's just not uh, Vinay Kumar's day today. One for 89 now. Now that's not going to four again, is it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. A three fours to start off with for Vinay Kumar. He's had some good performances over the years, but this one is the most expensive by an Indian bowler in limited overs internationals. Now that will go the distance to just about. Now, in the Australian camp, I just wonder if they're thinking, hang on longer. And he gets there. Well played, James Faulkner. The fastest century by an Australian batsman in limited overs internationals. 100 from 57. And he's done wonderfully well. It's an amazing character of the man. Now Makai in it as well. On this outfield, that's going to beat Shikhar Dhawan into the boundary. First four for... Clint Mackay, Australia, 86 from 69. Through the gap on the offside. I think he's just gone six inches longer, looking for the Yorker. Now 81 from 62. Australia alive here. That's in the gap as well. Be four more. Made the adjustment very late and gets into a good position. Marginally back of the leg. He hit it clean again. He's making it look so simple. Well, I tell you, he has hit this as clean as a whistle. And he's been do doing so for him tonight, hit for six. Oh, yeah! And he's knocked the ball out. Just a hint of turn, he's knocked back the off peg. Oh, Clint Mackay. With the intent here, just trying to force this down the ground. Just a fraction of turn. Jadeja, ecstatic. He knows how important that partnership, the break, was. Clint Mackay, dismissed for 18. Australia now 326 for nine. Now Fielder's coming underneath it. Is he there? Yes, he is! Shik Shikhar Dhawan has finished it. And a wonderfully brave and courageous innings from James Faulkner comes to an end. And you can see how worried the Indians were 
as they all congregate around Shikhar Dhawan. Now, gentlemen, go back and shake hands with James. Memorable innings from the young Australian. And there will be agony on his face, but he'll realise. Well, you can see from the celebrations by India and MS Dhoni that that got all a little bit tight in the end. Brilliant 100, the fastest ever by an Aussie in this form of the game. 116 off Sam Maxwell, who got the innings going, and of course to Shane Watson, who on one leg smashed. Now we're adding 115 for the ninth wicket. Three for 52 for Shams, a better form for him, and three for 73 for Ravi Jadeja. But I'm afraid of conditions for the bowlers. So India winning by 57 runs.